bitch. I'm gonna, I'm gonna turn around. Well, actually, I don't want it coming down to me, so it might be tough. Yeah, we might have to just get it from the back, actually. Okay. But it looks like it's on the oil pan up front. I guarantee. The last one we pulled out of this one, it destroyed the air, the oil pan in the radiator. I would say it's gonna come back down after the. I just go straight to. I know, I'm probably gonna want that wheel to turn is the thing. hook that edge we're uh i mean it's right there yeah but it's like i don't know if you could uh maybe lower it to maybe even it out a little bit it's like on under the road yeah. <laughs>
Maybe. I don't know. I think they by. They said they were somebody. Oh, okay. That might be. I don't know, man. It's going to be tough. I still think I might want to be up on the other side of it. He said snatch block to the to the truck on the lowest point in the bush and then pull it out the way. To the lowest point on the what? Like, put a snatch block there and snatch it over to the lowest point on the car and pull it up that way. I uh, that's to the lowest point on the car. To the lowest point the, over there. Yeah, I I can't get over there without damaging the bumper. Yeah, but I'll I'll rip his bumper. That strap will come right across that bumper. What's happening, man? I guess they call you too. Oh yeah. Yeah, well, they called us. And he's like, "Why, well, great?" He goes, "We'll let you have it. They could pay you, but they're gonna pay us for coming up here." That's crazy. I just, I just, I just knocked off two <laughs> gas pumps. Wow. Yeah, like. Yeah, he didn't say anything to me. He just, he just gave me an address and said, "Come." He didn't say he called anybody else, but that's your man standing back there behind it. I don't know. Oh, it's yeah, it's up under it. I don't I don't know that it'll be drivable anyway. That other side's horrible. It hit hard on that side. Over. That side's totaled. No, I just come down. Yeah, that whole wheel is. The wheel and everything's pushed up into the control on, or into the fender, so it, it won't be drivable anyway. You'll have to, I don't know if you've got somebody else coming to get you or not, but. It's under the road. I know it's it curves. Ah, uh, yeah. I know I've had a few of them right there, and then we've had a few up there on the other side of you. But I know I'm gonna try to lift that side over there. That side's totaled anyway, so.
try to get it up under there. See if it'll pull it up over. Oh, it definitely Yeah. Yeah, I was just, I was, I was worried about his bumper initially. I hate doing that because that strap goes right across the bumper. But it's. I've used chains for all, every time I do I don't use straps hardly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's crazy. Well, man, I, I hate that. Yeah, it's... Last time I was up here, we tried to put my I had it, I had it just about out. There's a little plate of the bed over the top. I'm gonna use a chain. Okay, No. I might need that one to pick it up. Right against that bank. Yeah, the keys. That it's it's in it, but it's turned about as hard as it'll go. That side over there's killed. It won't turn anymore. That side over there's mashed up into the. It's just going to catch that lip every time. What's that? that is it's it's bad up on the other side. Know that it'll ever go. He said he, he has this other record here. You want me to try to like put my bed down on the other side of that? Kind of just see if we can lift it. We almost brought both of our trucks, but that could work. Just get that bed slightly just right underneath that side and just uh -huh. pick that, that that side up, and then you could just pull it. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know what else. I, it looked like it was starting to climb, but I don't. Yeah, that other side's like killed. It, you know, it looks like it's catching the. Yeah, I know. That's the same thing on the back. I tried to pull the back first. Yeah. And it was it it caught the lip of the road. I was gonna say I can only imagine I mean I can lift it. Usually if I get them high enough, and then it'll go, it'll clear over, but yeah, that's that, that lip's pretty ornery, I don't know.
<laughs> it, it is out. <laughs> Yeah, that side is is it's completely smashed. Yeah. I, yeah, I tell Shorty, man, I'm sorry. I, I'll call tell him I'll call him later. Did you did you get anything from him? Nothing. Um, he'll want. I mean, I'll offer the telephone. Yeah, he'll want he's something. He's better than insurance. He really is. Yeah. Yeah, he'll he's want. He's better than settle that on insurance. You put it on. Oh yeah. That's all. Yeah, it's it's done on that end of it. I we'll probably. I mean, if you got a ride coming. Yeah. Okay. Uh, we'll, we'll give you our information. It'll end up going back to our lot. You'll have to call your insurance company and tell them. They'll total it, I'm sure. Um, but just tell them it's at our lot, and I'll make sure you've got the address on where it's going. And then you'll want to get a claim started and, and make sure that, you know, they've got it going. Because, yeah, they'll, I'd say they'll total it. That's pretty heavy on that side. So it looked like it got the frame and the control arm and all that stuff because the tire's pushed up. But... I'll make sure you've got that info before we take out and it'll go to our to our lot. If you need anything out of it while your people are coming, you're welcome to get in it now. It's, yeah, this is a rental. Okay, okay. Yeah, just make sure you've got all your belongings. The only thing I'll need is the key fob. Yeah, I'll call him, I'll call him, I'll call him. If you want to call him by leave, just here. Listen, you know him better than I do. I do, I do, and I know how frustrating this is. I'll get this stuff unhooked. Hey, I'm going to I'm going to pull forward so I can get this cable and, and chain. Yeah, boy, that'd have been tough. Either way, it's a tough one. I I learned my lesson. I knew where it was at and I brought the little one last time and ended up having to get both of them up here. I didn't have enough reach with the small one. I know I can get right at it. It helps a bunch. Did the other people stop? Did Did do we need to hang around for a police report? Okay. I started to say it's I mean it, it wasn't your fault, so I I just want I don't want you to be on the hook for the rental car stuff unless you got the full and then it doesn't really matter if you got the full coverage. Yeah, we're good. Okay, guys, welcome back to the channel. Twisty Turny Road up here on the back side of 321 in Gatlinburg. I got a FedEx truck that has Turn grown back. some roots. Then you will arrive at your destination. Oops. Oh, goodness. And I got a guy that's. She's gonna end up off the side of the mountain over here. I can't watch. Oh my goodness. I don't like this one at all. This is that same driveway that the people were off of. <laughs> they were drunk that night. They're drunk all night and then went to leave that morning. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And then the same driveway I met the people at, they were staying here. I don't like this at all. Can I get I can't get to the you other side. This is a dead you. end. No, uh-uh. I almost had him. <laughs> uh oh. I've been. I've got stacked. I've stacked the gravels and everything, but he's a very newbie. Gotcha. <laughs> and I didn't have a, anything to pull him, but I would have got him. Gotcha. I've been in these predicaments before. Oh yeah, for sure. It very happens. Very young and. Uh, That's the only thing that I can do is I can't get around him. So. Uh -huh. he's got a hat if I would, I was going to try to pull him. He's got a big chunk of. A pavement. I come up through here just to flying because I got an owner up there waiting on me, and I'm like, oh my god, this is the only way I can get. I know. Here. I was just looking at the map. I've been here in this driveway several times. Everybody does that pulling out of that driveway. Like I said, he's very young, very let down, very hurt. Mm, it but happens. We, tried, we moved him. I moved him actually a little bit, but I was afraid I was going to get my arm or something. Yeah, no, it's not worth getting hurt over, huh? I think I can. I probably just pull him from the front, just drag him back down, I guess because I can't get around it at all. We'll see what the front winch does first and we can leave everything right there where it's at, so. 
Yeah, it shouldn't take very long. Well, we tried. Like I said, Zeddy just called you off. Oh, yeah. I think I'm just gonna pull the wheel. Um, if uh, if you want to get in, and then just turn hard as you can my way, and uh, probably just neutral would be okay. okay. And keep your. Yeah, he can let off. Yeah, I want him to come down. I'll back all the way down. Okay. It's free. <laughs> all right, guys, that wasn't too horrible. I uh, hope he's not too hard on himself here. It's okay up here, isn't it? I think it's truck is fine too. Okay. Oh yeah. Uh, just a little bit of blacktop. Hey guys, we've been here before many times. Just got that bumper. Uh, but yeah, heck of a deal. This is a crazy driveway to try to pull out of or back up in. So FedEx drivers, UPS drivers, mailmen, for this area, you've got your work cut out. Okay guys, like I said, uh, you know, the mailman, FedEx, UPS, any delivery service up here, Grubhub, <laughs> pizza guys, you've got your work cut out for you on these roads here. You just, uh, it's just a little worse for the uh, for the bigger guys here. Um, you know, the UPS trucks and the FedEx trucks, those big box trucks are crazy. And they'll often drop that tailgate down and, and just get hung up and it happens all the time. But he was kind of a new driver, taking it hard on himself there, but it happens. You just have to be mindful that that back end's gonna drag and, and it's gonna be kind of crazy. I have no idea where I I'm at. I always get lost here, but I think we're supposed to go left. But I can't, uh, no, I don't know. We'll go left anyway. <laughs> Who knows where we're supposed to go, but we'll go left. But yeah, you have to have nerves of steel to drive something like that around here. Yeah, it's, it's kind of crazy. But anyway, it's an absolute beautiful day down here, guys. Stick around, stay tuned. I'm sure we got some more crazy stuff coming your way. It, it's that one there. Okay. Um, yeah. I, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna turn around. If you can, please. Uh, can you come over here with? Well, yeah. Show the damage on that bumper before he touches the lower. See here that it sticks out a little bit.
Okay, so they were parked right here in front of this dumpster, right here, like this. Right there where it says no parking. And can you put the cones back? Awesome. Thank you so much. All right. Everything auto. Hello. Hello, yes. Can I, yeah, do you guys do in like a blue car? Uh, what was the location? Uh, I, don't, I don't know. She didn't tell me the location, but I think that was this morning. Like, you know, like probably like 11 or 12 o'clock. We've got, we've got a little a blue car that came from... Uh, the uh, Candy Kitchen uh, employee parking lot? Yeah, I think so. Yes, sir. Yeah, they called us for the removal on that one. Then how much you got to pay now? Uh, it's cash. We can only accept cash, and it has to be the registered owner. So ID has to match that registration. Uh, I'm going to Okay, just let us know if uh, when you're going to, because I don't have anybody at the lot, so you'd have to let me know when you're coming that way. Okay, I will. Okay, thank you. Hello. Hi. I can pick up my car, please. Uh, the, uh, the white, or uh, the blue? Yeah, the blue one. Okay, are you the registered owner? No. Okay, your ID matches the registration? Yes. Okay. Hello. Hello. Mm -hmm. Hello. Yes, ma'am. Okay. Mm -hmm. you, have you got keys? I'll bring it up here to you. Yes, yes. Yeah. I'll get you a receipt. Let me get you a receipt. Okay. You guys, you guys working? there yes. yes i'm working there what what store are you working at uh, i'm pop pop culture pop culture okay yeah, yeah they so, were uh, uh the boss uh, tell just told me th uh, this morning i keep parking everywhere so yeah just... yeah they'll call they'll call because it's it's a no parking zone right there yeah, so they yeah, call yeah. so just be careful yeah, over yeah. there i hate that that happened but um yeah, just be careful. Yeah, thank you so much. You're welcome. Have a good one, okay? Yeah, thank you. Okay, guys. Uh, you heard that one. Working at Pop Culture. Pop Culture is definitely not supposed to park outside the gates in the alley. <laughs>